Hello, everyone, and welcome to another episode of Iron Panther Presents. Uh, today, Stacey and I shall be discussing The Ruthless as we talk about Season 4, Episode 21. We're going to wrap this thing up next week. But before we get to this, let's get to the intro. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I got, I got to do it now. Wait, wait, wait. This is going to be funny. Wait, wait, wait. You ready? <laughs> I got to do it. This is awesome. This is awesome. This is amazing. I love it. It was psychological. It was emotional. Extremely entertaining. Uh, but as always, as we try to say here, uh, as we said, uh, if you are new to the channel, please uh, subscribe to the channel. Um, and as we talk about this video, please uh, like on the video and comment on the video, and we will get back to you as soon as possible. That's right. Uh, celebration for Easter or Resurrection Weekend or whatever you want to say. Uh, I hope you guys are having a good meal and good family time. Uh, Stacey and I are together uh, uh, and because she is my family. She's part of my family. So we're, we're going we're gonna to do this, uh, uh, this review for y'all. Uh, anyway. Uh, Stacey, what did you think of this episode as we prepare for the finale uh, next week? It tried to do something. I was a bit confused. We got a heist. We got a coup. Is that the correct term for it? I don't know. Um, we got Malcolm in the woods for some reason throwing up. Um, I suppose to Malcolm in the middle. We still ain't addressed the dead pig. Was it barbecued, fried, sauteed, made into sausage? I need answers. Um. All right. So let's uh, let's let's break down the first one. Uh, this is a heist. It's a it's a it's an organized event. So off camera, they planned that George and Lewis was going to take the leadership hostage. Apparently, while Ruth sneaks into the Hyas's trailer. Uh, and physically takes all the money, then takes the money to the abandoned ass car that George and his girl were about to fuck in, and then they're gonna run off into the night. So it's all coordinated. She put money in a sheet and she ran across. Like I'm thinking, like when you get like appropriate equipment to like. Move the money. Hey, like a sheet. Where's the safe? That's what I was thinking. Like, clearly the money's not in the safe because they don't have the instructions. But shouldn't she saw the safe to be like, that's where their money is supposed to be? Like, what? Like, oh, my God, they got a safe. They're trying to lock. Like, where's the safe? Yeah, because many stole the directions because some of you was supposed to do something with the safe. Thank you. Know. Thank you for remind. Yes, he stole the instructions. Well, in the event that this they way they could crack the safe, in the event that they actually put the money into the safe, they could use the instructions to to open the, the override the the, uh, the 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 lock, and then they could get the money. That was the plan. But no one ever actually touched it. Uh, so yeah. But did you notice? Because they for some reason they shot it like this. They're showing you the highest in the chair giving his prophecy in front of the entire Raku camp, right? Mm -hmm. And you see Ruth walk through the front door mm -hmm. right in front, right behind him. Mm -hmm. Which means Daikon should have saw her. Elder Mother should have saw everybody should have been like, what is Ruth doing going into the house's <laughs> trailer? Like, what? She was preparing to wash his feet. It's funny you bring this up because when she's like, "May I wash your feet?" I was like, I thought she was gonna offer to mouthwash the uh, the maker stick to be to be oh real. I, I I was because she was definitely like she definitely was taking Jones' advice of like fuck his brains out so he don't ask questions. And she was like. Can I? Yeah, he got a pedicure instead. Right? He was like, oh, thank you, and baby. Oh. And the conversation about how dumb women are. You know, I'm just a lonely one. But since I have a male child, I have male brain, and I can think a little bit clearer. Like, what? what? <laughs> how, how much confidence does a man have to have to be like, my semen makes women smarter? Like, he was like, just me putting it in you. Now you that you got more brain cells. That's actually a good line, men. Like, if you want to get a girl to be like, "Hey, how about 
how about you suck it? Uh, there's a there's a future in it for you. Like you might that how you think Monica Lewinsky wrote, wrote her book? I'll try you know, Chris Rock did a similar joke. I'm just trying to put that one together. My fault. Uh the ending was shocking uh, that they would want to take on out the highest. Uh, wasn't prepared for that. Um we're not just shooting, just pew pew and Dyka and pew pew and just keep them moving. It looks more dram dramatic to take the leadership hostage. I get that, but there's a hole in the fence. Just take the money and go through the hole and be gone because Peter is gone and they're not even worried about that. Aaron is gone and no one's asked the question, what happened with Aaron? You know, the one who's not part of us that could be snitching. Like, are we going to get to this? Like, what? what is what? But they did write off Peter. I like I like it was Daikon talking to George, I think. And he was like, don't worry about him. He's just out there. He's one of us. He may come back. Uh, why would he do that? Uh, and is he running around butt naked? I thought he was naked, too. But I'm like, I know Peter had clothes. But either way, no one found the hole. No one found the hole that Malcolm used to leave. So, like, aren't y'all going to act? I want to get. I want. I want to. Oh, Joan. Okay, Joan. Joan and Ruth talking their way out of being in trouble with the highest. Hilarious. I love. I love the genuine like situation where Ruth is like, "What do I say?" Because I have no idea what Joan said, and she's like, "We were in love with you." And they're <laughs> arguing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And Joe's like, yes, yes, that's what you know. In the streets, they say I would kill a bitch. And he's like, ooh, they say that in the streets. Like you were in prison, bro. Like, like you haven't been the highest your whole life. Like, you do know the streets. So I'm I'm really confused no. how all, all of that sin was washed away. He was purified. Mm. How many times he was purifying men in the in the in, in the prisons? But uh, it was a uh, I, I I loved it. I was like I was and Joan has the most beautiful eyes. Like I love her big eyes. Like they 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 just they they capture me. But it's also interesting how she randomly asks wears glasses at random ass times. Like are you close, nearsighted or farsighted? Because they just come on and off at will for like no reason, and I'm very confused. Like like help me understand. Also, maybe like get, do something, be consistent. Like, I don't understand what's happening with these glasses. But then remember, y'all, the only reason Joan needs to be talking to the highest is because they need her email address, which somehow still wasn't brought up. They need they need the email address, right? So they can ask for the instructions so they can use right. the state. And this still has not been addressed by anyone. Not Daikon, not the highest. No, he wants to be like, I was meditating and I saw y'all two arguing and I just need to know. I need your email address, girl. Like, that's what I need. So, Kent, let's, let's get to that, please. <laughs> Ah, uh, uh, the safe is where is where the Joan and River did were uh, were planning to take the money. The Joan and River did were planning the, what? Okay, so you saying the safe is not there? Help me out. Okay, okay, let's one more time. Uh, the safe is located in the trailer where Joan keeps the accounting books, I believe. No, she already has a safe. Like that's not the same thing. Like the the, the hot spot, not her draws, like the actual internet hotspot, is in the safe. And they unlock it, much like her draws, and then they take out the hot spot. Like that. So she has her own safe. But the new brand new safe was carried into the highest trailer by the big strong men. Like that happened. So th these are these are two different things. But the question is, where the fuck's the safe? And then why am I carrying pounds of money when Joan has a virtual account with one million dollars? How long are they going to survive off of one measly million dollars? Remember that argument? 
I remember that. Like, this is some silly shit. And then I'm like, hold up. Well, wait. Ruth, if you can just walk in and by yourself carry out half a million dollars in weight, like you have that kind of strength, why do you need any of these other motherfuckers? Go in there, take the money, and use the same hole that Malcolm used and just leave. This, this doesn't make sense. <laughs> Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Let, fuck it, fuck it. Let's get, let's get, let's get the Malcolm. Cause this, why was George acting like he was genuinely surprised? Lewis, it was, it was George or Lewis? Fuck, which one? Which one? The mumble mouth motherfucker with the, with the hot fade. Which one is he? I can't tell him apart. Uh, George? I feel like it's George. But anyway, George. why was he acting surprised that he found Malcolm out there in the first place? You went looking for him. <laughs> He said, why are you here? How did you get here? I caught a deer. Why are y'all using code? It's only your radios. But you went out there looking for him. He genuinely looked surprised. Like, oh, my God. what? You, mm, mm, but how'd you get here? Stand up. My foot is in a fucking bear trap. What, what are you talking about? <laughs> Back oh, one goodness. more time. Where is Malcolm? George said he was bringing them back, right? That's what he said, right? I'm a, we actually said we. He said, like, who? So, how, where is he? Like, he should have been dragged back with a fucked up foot and being like, how did you get out of the camp? Who did you tell? Did you run into anybody? None of this is discussed. He should be back in the punishment trailer laughing like the Joker. None of this is discussed. <laughs> I don't, I don't get it. Uh, hello, hello. Uh, thank you very much again for joining us. Oh, we got, I just got back from church. I still, I still caught y'all. Thank you very much. We were, this is me. This is my fault. Like, I want to, I want to, I want to explain. Like, so yesterday, Stacey and I were like, hey, let's record a one. And then I said, hey, let's record a three. And then I said, hey, fuck that. I'm about to eat. So let's record a one. And then we're going back and forth, back and forth. So, and then I just hit the button. I'm late. So this is all my fault. I'm just saying, if, you, if you're trying to catch us, you're trying to go by the schedule, just say, David, what is your thing? And I'm like, I do what I want. Anyway, but I appreciate y'all being a part of it, and I appreciate Stacy being flexible in a schedule way. That's another thing. But I do, I do, I, I do, I do appreciate uh, you, you, you being there for me. Um, let's talk about flexibility real quick. Let's uh, let's get into Bridget and uh, George. I think George was with them in the in the in the uh, abandoned vehicle with all the paper and shit, whatever, whatever. Mm -hmm. When did they coordinate the meeting? That doesn't that doesn't make sense. Like the last time we saw Bridget, she just got her ass whooped by, by Ruth. She was sent off not to open her mouth again. And all of a sudden she's sitting in the fuck you car and then and then all of a sudden coordinated. And then Ruth is like, she's waiting for you. Where? You know who? You know where? Well, we don't know who and we don't know where. So what I don't know what this whole conversation is for. Wasn't she the one that would draw like on the bottom of the the cup? Like she would send messages. Wasn't she the one? I think I want to say so. I can't. I can't. I, let's just say so. Let's just say because like it ain't that many characters with lines and shit. Okay. But I feel like it was her. Yeah. So they handed each other at some point off camera a cup of water, and then that's how the plot. Yeah. And I'm like, this doesn't. This doesn't make sense. But anyway, then she's like, why'd you fuck her? So her don't need the Instagram model with the titties. She still don't have a name. Like, I'm like, yeah. and then the information, the woman don't ask what information for what I fucked her for us. What do you mean for us? Like, how's this helping us? No, she don't even ask. He had to make up something. <laughs> but every, any woman with any kind of sense would ask these questions. Like, women would definitely be like, what information? What did she give you? Huh? Like, they'd be like, oh, baby, I, I can't tell you that. You're a woman, and my seed hasn't made you smart yet. I don't know. And then, like, I, I, like give me something. And then they were about to get the draws. I was like, please don't tell me they're going to get it back in this beat-ass car and, like, try to get it. But let's not. Come on, Tyler Perry. This is this is hurting my feelings. Uh, They are not on yet. You talking about us? Uh, Wow. Uh, Actually, it wasn't off camera because Ruth and Lewis had a talk about about they about them talking 
about them taking the hot the hostages. Oh, the high, really? All right, all right. I will. I I don't remember that because that would have been a big conversation. So I don't. I don't remember. I don't remember that. So, uh, but uh, they actually uh, did talk about it. All, talk about it. All of that. Uh, they tried that before the highest uh, slaughtered everyone who ran through the fence. Okay, I do remember. I do remember the Negan moment. Yes, um, but that means the hole is still there. So that again doesn't make any sense. There's no one protecting the hole or, or sewing up the hole. If that is the same hole. Let's just say it is. Let's just let's just throw it out there. Um, I thought the plan was simply take the money. They were going to wait. While the while the highest was doing his prophecy, and they're simply we're going to go in and take the money. I don't know. I don't remember the hostage situation. Uh, but either way, it looked cool. It, I I got to give it that. Like it looked really cool. So I'm like, is this the end of this show? Is someone simply just going to shoot George and Lewis and call this a day? Because you can't come back from this. I don't think to be like they're just back on the block guarding the the door after this. <laughs> Also, I just want to point out attention to detail. Manny's still limping because of his messed up penis. Like, I like the fact that he was like highest. Like, he's still doing, you know, I was like, okay, you haven't forgotten uh, uh, that your, that your Why penis. Why did they go get his gun? The big one. Ah. That's, a, that's how you hold the place hostage. By pulling out the whole, like, you, you, the Uzi machine gun. That shit looked like something from Predator, yeah. actually. That's all I was gonna. Uh, um, Somebody should have been on the roof with that gun, just in case. Because, you know, there's still snipers out there. What happened to the snipers? Good point. Did they come in to listen to the prophecy as well? Maybe. What happened to all the men that were just running around in circles with a cup of Kool Aid when the show came back? When the FBI showed up. That's what they should do. They should whip out the Kool Aid. They just be like, drink. Drink, Either bitch. you with us or you get the Kool Aid. That's a good point, right? That's good. That's good. Like I'm like, go get the Kool Aid. Uh oh, oh, oh. Was Malcolm taken back to the to the Raku after Z? That's my question. That's why I'm saying like he sh that should have been a thing because after George told him, yeah, uh, told him his foot is bleeding, uh, that he did. Uh, again, so George, it was George. So George was the one out there. Um, if that's the, if, the, if the names are correct, um, it's, it's hard to tell them apart at this point, to be real. But anyway, the guy was supposed to drag him back. He said, do you need help? He said, no, I got it. And then we never saw Malcolm again. And somehow he didn't bleed to death or he didn't have to cut off his foot or something. So I'm like, I'm not sure what's going on with Malcolm in this particular uh, uh, situation. Um, let's talk about booty. Um, Yes, yes. It's been a while since Daikon has gotten the need for booty. And apparently uh, he's it's starting to rile up. It's starting to rile up. Um, because it was Lewis. I get Lewis, the, the, who, who, who replaced the mother actor. He touched. He touched Daikon. Uh, Lewis and Bridget. All right, all right. Thank you. Thank you. It was Lewis. Okay. So Lewis... Touched Daikon's shoulder, and Daikon was like, "Don't play. You touch me, you need to be touching." And I was like, oh. <laughs> I was like, I was like, you know what that means? Suck it." I was like, "Oh no, that's not what that means, sir." I'm like, "I'm not sure why we're doing this." And uh, Lewis is like, "Let me back." It's funny he didn't share that story though, because then George Daikon was like, "Hey George, you want to bow down? Let me show you how to do that. Why don't you come to my trailer?" George was like, oh, we got to steal this money. I can't, I can't be doing that. Uh, sorry, sorry. <laughs> that was, that was classic. I, lo I loved it. I loved it. I love George. Like, Hey guy, uh, Daikon just said to come over. Uh, <coughs> he said he wanted to smell my penis. And I was like, I don't, I don't, I don't do that. I don't, I don't want to do that. Uh, th th that was, that was Andrew just for the record. I just want to say this is, this ain't the first time Daikon has been like, let me let me do the Pepsi challenge and see uh, which one tastes better. Um, that being said, it would be interesting if the reason Daikon is acting out like this is because he believes that Ruth has taken his place and therefore the highest is 
he has to move on. That the highest the, no longer favors him, and now he's looking for something. If they, if they, if they want to tie that together. Uh, Ruth and Lewis, Lewis did discuss. Yes, Bridget drew. Uh, yes, yes, did, uh, did uh, Lewis, Bridget did draw, draw on a club. Well, thank you. All right. Um, so we're, we're getting it was Lewis. God damn it. Okay, so I saw a photo that Bridget held a gun at Ruth's head. Yeah, uh, I guess that's happening at the season finale. Yeah, but you know, it's her show, so she'll, she'll be all right. Uh, she'll, she'll be right. Bridget don't learn her lessons, does she? Well, this could be payback. I mean, Ruth did whoop her ass for a while, and somehow she has no bruises whatsoever. Uh, but yes, it could. It could. Be. She needs to be shooting that IG bitch. That's what she needs to be finding. All right, to be like, hey, what information did you give my my man besides chlamydia? Like, oh man. Mm-hmm. I don't know what I'm saying. That's not really information. I just want to throw that in there. Anyway. Um, <laughs> back back to the pig. Back to the pig real quick, Stacey. Uh, Elder Mother should have been looking into the pig just to make sure how and why the pig died. That to your point. Like, oh, broke his neck. Right? Hmm. So it was not my, my poisoning. It was the, the broken neck. And who did that? Um... Mm-hmm. Not that we indo- in, in, in condone this in any way, but it's weird that all of a sudden Lacey is no longer the glory hole for the camp. Like, that was supposed to be a thing. And that only happened once. And the elder mother somehow forgot that she was trying to get her pregnant and make bastards or whatever. Um, And then, like, that didn't turn into nothing. Like, it was an unnecessary scene. I was like, why, why are we doing this? And somehow she forgot. So plot holes um just a uh yes when ruth uh met lewis in the car uh oh okay that's when they were discussing it you're saying that's when they were discussing when they met in the car so be it so be it 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 was a complete surprise to me that somehow the 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 plan was to take uh uh the highest and diacon hostage is what i'm saying so uh and again very shocking I'm, i'm interested to see how they play this thing out um i almost believe that they may move to another location but tyler perry ain't spending that kind of money so I, I'm, I'm trying to figure out how they all of a sudden get rid of that storyline when they move into the next season like what the feds figure out somehow where the kids are and the fact that they were going to move to the hotel and the feds take the hotel so he can't move yes that's why I'm, that, I feel. I feel like that. That's that's what's going. On. Also, Stacy, or that they could have been undercover, like the little pervert guy that they're supposed to be working with. It's actually an undercover fed. I that that would be good too. That would be good too. Um, but we never seen this dude. Just like we never seen uh the the, the cartel and all the queen's men. We have none of these fuckers. Uh, but that would be good. All of a sudden, it's all undercover. I like, I like that. Listen to the speech, though. What, what, what's that, Lord? What's that, Lord? I can. We're about to lead to the promised land. Yes, you will have what? Air conditioning. What? And running right. water. Mm-hmm. What? Thank you, Raku. Internet. No, nah, he didn't I say that. Know. He didn't say I that. Know. He said, running <laughs> water. For the rest, of the but I'm like, you know, you know how else you can get that? Just walking out the door, like that's some basic shit. Go get a job, get a place. You don't need a job. Just walk to the store. They got air conditioning and they got running water. Like you can, any place pretty much has air conditioning. Like you can, you can get that. Like none of this is that impressive. They're like, oh my god, it's like they were born in the Raku camp. And they've never left. Like that would make sense for them to be this silly, and this. Mm. And, and this. They did not mention uh, the Jews in Egypt. Not. I don't want this video to get canceled. I'm just. I'm just saying. But I'm like. But I mean, for, from a biblical perspective, I mean, I'm saying he's trying to be Moses in essence uh, and leading his people to the Promised Land. Uh, uh, air conditioning. Yeah, I was like, that's the best you got. And again, one more time, where are the other parents? 
who are asking, where are our children? Plural. Ruth is not the only one with a child at this camp. And no one but her, who all of a sudden gives a fuck about her child, is like, where are the children? What was Laura? Is that her name? The her wife. friend? Aaron's wife. Did we see her? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She was there clapping. She was there clapping. Oh, okay. Uh, um, uh, where did they take the dead FBI agent? Thank you, Marcus. Thank you. Which one? Once Mac, no, he's talking about Mac. Once Mac blew his oh. brains out in the middle of the fucking police station, somehow they cleaned all that shit up because they were, because, uh, Cal, Desiree, and Aaron were, ha and, and other random FBI agents are just walking around living their best life right where Mac blew his brains out. Yeah. Did his no. wife come pick up the body or so, what? that's why he's married, right? Like something, the, something like where are the FBI? Where are the guys to pick up the body? This should be a crime scene. No one has even mentioned this. Where's that black agent that used to be that again that worked with Andrew, I think, and was like and, and trying to like trying to recruit him? Like, wh where is that? Like, what happened to Matt? They still have not picked up uh, that sheriff deputy's body. She's still on the street. <laughs> Maybe the rednecks but got her by now. We don't even know what happened to Deliverance. Like, what happened to those two dudes? They just should, they should have found Malcolm in that bear trap and just went to town and be like, we will never see him again. Like, it just sorry, buddy. The woods got you. Like, that's something, something. Mm -hmm. Lewis, so that was Lewis, right? Lewis tries to take Malcolm away. Redneck show up, and it's like, it's either you or him, but somebody's coming home with us. And he's like, Yeah, right. That's that's him. Like the, the rock who said that's your that's your sacrifice right there. We're just gonna move out right now. Sorry, sir. Uh that would have been hilarious. And then Malcolm's like, please, please, please take me back to the rock who camp, please. <laughs> I cannot be assaulted. Um <laughs> I was I, I didn't I don't I don't understand. And then they say Cal and Desiree were like, "Yo, they've already killed a sheriff deputy. Terrible. It's two of them. It's two of them because the other one got killed." Yeah. <laughs> the the guy right like dead. Still haven't found his body. And Andrew is not saying anything about where he put that body because he was the one that had to clean it up. Mm -hmm. He's in I was like, damn it. I was like, what's up with the Diacon was trying to get uh, with Andrew even when he was uh, doing it with the highest. That is true. That is true. But I'm, I I thought, again, I thought maybe he was like, I'm just looking for something new. But it just like, Diacon just got really horny this episode because he was trying to go after both of uh, uh, George and Lewis. Uh, maybe he was looking for a tag team. Uh, that was part of the plan for Bridget to pretend to hold Ruth hostage? Hmm. Oh, you're talking about that hasn't happened yet. You're talking about like next episode. Next episode. That's 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 what you must be referring to next episode. Uh Malcolm did say his uh stomach is upset after eating. That's true. Thank you, Marcus. So the poisoning sandwich is fine, is finally starting to take effect. Um, it's just me. It could be. Did you notice the branch sticking out of his hair? Out of Malcolm's <laughs> hair. <laughs> I could, I could not know. Like when he fell on the ground, he's like, "Oh my god, oh my god, my foot!" Right when Lewis picks him up, right, like there's a, it's like a big ass stick sticking out of the top of his head. And then I was like, "I think he can get rid of that." I was like, oh, "There's gonna be like that makes it more real." I don't know. I was like, "Get that shit out of his head!" Like it looks ridiculous. And then like it just kind of, it kind of sat there for a little bit while he was talking. And I was like, just off camera, just be like, Boop. and then I don't know. Um, it 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 it, it, it tickled me. Uh, with the uh, with that, um, we got Malcolm has been uh, suffering a, a long time. Uh, Malcolm's been going through withdrawals, um, and now he's sick. Uh, so there's a lot of there's a, there's a lot of things uh going on with him. Um, yeah. he got electrocuted. He got frozen. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. 
He's he's now now his foot's fucked up. Yo, he's going the distance. <laughs> it could be because he's light skinned and, and good looking, and, and and Tyler Perry don't want to get rid of him yet. Uh, and uh, it, it could be that. Um, I ain't trying to be that way, but you know, it's not coincidence. You know, all the other black ones are dead, just for the record. And uh, and, and, and Andrew Andrew's locked up. Um, where the fuck is Andrew? Do we, do we see Andrew this episode? No, we didn't, because mm-hmm. the sheriff all of a sudden has cancer. Um, is uh hanging out in the front because just because because hey, he had to go to the bathroom and why is he just sitting there? Right, like you got pee in the cup. Well, I mean, just take your ass back. You are a prisoner. Like you, exactly. as they just pointed out, you you orchestrated the death of a of a law enforcement officer. So why why are we just like, well, he has cancer. It's it's okay. Like it's it's not okay. It's, 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 he's old. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Uh, George uh, deserves to get uh, seated, <laughs> but all that butt kissing he's doing with to Daikon. You're right, though. Yeah, it would. Yeah, just a little bit, just a little bit. Like this, this Daikon can just get to tip in and be like, "Nah, I'm just kidding." Um, uh, much like P Diddy gra- grabbing anus. <laughs> that's that's the other video. Anus. I was like, how do you do that? Like, I'm ask Tyler Perry, he knows. Uh, how many episodes in this season? Uh, this the, uh, next this year, next season is the last episode 22 episodes. Uh, this season he went the distance, so uh, next week will be the finale. Um, and we will discuss that on Saturday. Uh, since I will be uh, no Friday, I'm going Sunday, so Friday, Friday, yeah. All right, so we'll discuss that on Friday. We get it. Stacey got schedules and shit. Uh, but we will, we will, we will, we will do that. Um, what else? What else? River, River to the, River still has not told Joan that all they want from her is the email account because they're trying to gain that. To, they're trying to fix the safe, and so she still thinks that they're after her because of the money. Daikon still has not confronted her about said money. Actually. Uh, what's up with the million dollars? What are you trying to do? Let's do it together. That hasn't been anything. Um, Sam, uh, Richard, and Priscilla have not showed up to save their granddaughter because that's they still in play. Um, they'll be at the hotel, huh? They'll be at the hotel. (laughs) Her name, Nancy. How about this? How about this? Off camera, Nancy, Richard, and the equalizer, like he goes equalizer with Sam, finds the the, the daughter, the granddaughter at the hotel, saves her, saves all the kids, and, and then and they shut it all down. That that's how law enforcement gets involved. Um to acknowledge the the extended uh oval universe uh of this uh mm-hmm. of this situation. Um and then that I run to the security guard that's been walking to the camp. Forever. That's, that's my line. <laughs> like, damn it, that dude's still walking. <laughs> damn it. I was like, oh, but that being said, see, you can't do that because technically Manny would have been pulled out and got his ass whooped by the devil, uh, aka Max, um, which didn't happen in this universe. Uh, Bobby would have to have showed up, um, uh, which was hilarious. All that hilarious. I do, I, I do kind of want Bobby and Max in this thing for no reason. Like, I again, I want them to be like detectives private detectives hired by the senator to look for aaron and then they show up and they're like hey oh you're aaron okay he's like yo please go inside and save my wife and they're like we got this and then max and then max and bobby can go undercover again like i, I just i just want them together it, 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 it tickled me uh, uh, uh for, for some reason um also aaron are we are we expected to believe that that law enforcement is going to take Aaron with them when they storm the 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 the, the Raku camp? I don't know because why is he just sitting there? Like, what are we doing, bro? Like, like this guy tried to have you murdered. So, like, why are you just having a conversation? Like, why are you not with your senator dad? And he's like, no, I'm going back. So again, are we expected to believe that he's going to on his own sneak back into the camp and try to save his wife? Or he's gonna lead the charge since he's able to interrogate suspects and shit. Like, I, I don't. Uh, where's uh mother elder? Uh, elder mother. 
Um, are you talking about um Miss Cleo? I Miss Cleo. She was a uh, she was in this talking about roots. I'm tired of roots. <laughs> That's I, I don't know. I, I, I if I was her, I'd be I'd be mad that they're making fun of me because like that, for that kind to be like you mean Ruth or Ruth? I'm like a fuck you. Just <laughs> <laughs> let me tell your future. I'm going to kill you. Oh, that's the other thing. I'm sorry. So then, elder mother tries to recruit Daikon into killing Ruth's baby to make the, the to restore the balance, um, if you will. Um, of power uh, between uh, Elder Mother, uh, Diacon, and and the Highest, which I thought I thought was actually pretty good. I thought that, I thought that was, like you would see like Game of Thrones or some shit. Um, I, I'm surprised Joan hasn't uh, confessed from all the anxiety of not getting caught. You are you are correct. Um, it's interesting she hasn't just broke down. Uh, but again, find the hole, Joan. Pause. Find the hole and just like walk through and go get your money, girl. You have no allegiances. Nobody gives a fuck about you. Like you, you and you and Ruth are not friends. You know, River's just an opportunist. You have access to the money. Just walk your ass out and and and, and change your beautiful clothes and your beautiful eyes and just leave. I would love for that to like, after all said and done. The finale is Joan is gone. <laughs> Like, oh shit, where did she go? Like million dollars gone. And then somehow they finally get back to the internet and finally find a computer that works or pull out their phone, which they had before, just for the record. And they go and they go look at the account and a million dollars is just gone. And they're like, Joan took it. She and Laura, Laura, that her name, right? The wife, right? She and Laura do it. Because remember now, now the story is Laura and Joan have been working on this scheme this whole time. And Laura wasn't mm -hmm. there to get pregnant because that hasn't come back again. For the record, uh, River is a fool. Uh, it, th they're all kind of foolish. Uh, uh, yes. Um, but again, he ain't, he ain't asking no questions about Peter. Um, I, I was like, I, I don't know. Uh, River said he handled the safe in Jones' office uh, off camera. <laughs> I was like, no, it, no, that's not that's not a thing. Anyway, they still need. To, no, he said he got rid of the laptop, right? But Joan still thinks that they're trying to find the account and look into the account. Um, so, so the whole thing about getting the email address has not been uh, discussed. Uh, uh, they should have River and Ruth run uh, to the Oval Office <laughs> to, to report about Raku. I love it, and then they run into and then they run into Jason in this universe, and River's like, "Oh shit." Is that is that you? Is that me? What is going on? Uh, and then Ruth's sister, who's still alive in this universe, the twin sister, she finds out that the twin sister is fucking the president. And then we bring Hunter and Victor and Victoria and all of them in, in into this thing. Um, so that's that's possible. Um Barry should show up and save his daughter. Yes, because he's not dead in this universe. So he could, he could, he could show. So it could be a family affair. Um, it's still, it's some silly shit. Anyway, uh, we'll, 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 we'll see what's gonna happen next week, y'all. Um, and uh, it's it's gonna be fun. Uh, Friday, Friday, Friday. So tune in. Uh, different bat time, different bat channel. Well, same bat channel. Uh, the uh, uh, same channel. Uh, Dying Panther Panther channel. Uh, all right. Uh, uh Stacey, anything else? Because I'm home. <laughs> No, uh, please help us reach 500 views per video and 2,000 subscribers. Thanks, Stacey. You, know? you said that so naturally. We got to work on this shit. Like, she's like, I don't know. Dude. I just read the script. I was like, damn it. I'm HR and I advertise it, damn it. That's true. She does. She That's true. Stink to your strengths. Stick to your strengths. And, and we appreciate you. Uh, and we will see you again. Uh, please stay in the back room. Uh, don't get me in the back. All right, guys. Uh, thank you guys very much for hanging out with us. Um, as Stacy pointed out, our goal out yes, 500 views per video. Help us find somebody else that wants to see us say the silly shit, and then like let's see what we do, or just watch the video every day. Like let's do that. Like if you just and and maybe that'll get the views up. I don't know. Um, and then in yeah, 2,000 subscribers, we're doing pretty good. Uh, uh with that, uh, thanks to Jamani truly in the shorts and all that kind of stuff. Um, and please enjoy uh, your weekend, however you celebrate it. I hope you have a great time. Um, have a great week. 
Um, and we will be back uh, Friday and Saturday. Um, Ruth, we'll, we'll say goodbye to Ruth on Friday evening. Uh, Saturday, we will do BMF Season 3, Episode 6, um, uh, Diaria of, uh, of Detroit. Uh, we're going to do that when it's over. I actually like that show. So, uh, But uh, we're going to wait till that show is over um, and do that um, and, do, and do some more silliness as we go on. Uh, but until next time, I will say thank you guys very much for hanging out with us. I see people watching us in the chat. I, I enjoyed the view. I don't know what the fuck I was watching. <laughs> Rewatch this. Rewatch this when we're done. Rewatch this. You'll, you'll see what we're talking about. You'll be like, oh shit. It's hilarious. <laughs> Absolutely <laughs> hilarious. You want to go there? Oh shit. Casey, do your thing. Fuck that shit. Uh, but anyway, uh, please like, you can share, and comment on the video and all that kind of stuff as they say. We're just going to end this broadcast and say bye.